right, welcome. This is Seb Rantigan. Thank you for taking action and checking out the video marketing domination um, three step series that I've put together for you that I know is going to help you to find your ideal buyers, get them hunting you down, and having them wanting to buy from you and not your competition. Okay, that's the important thing because um, a lot of people are catching on to the fact that. Uh, video marketing is the, is the next big thing, um, but it's here to stay. It's no fad. It really isn't, and it's been growing and growing for a very long time. And so, part of this presentation is to um, really share some statistics with you that are going to absolutely blow you away. Um, but I'm not going to uh, give you death by PowerPoint and just give you loads of stats. I want to also uh, make sure this is relevant to you and make sure that uh, you will get the most out of this three step series and. Uh, really just to help you to improve your video marketing game wherever you're at and um, I'm excited to help you with that so uh, without any further ado I'm going to jump right into it and uh, so let's let's get going so question for you is this you are you a total video marketing newbie and uh, if, if so there's nothing to be ashamed about um, because that means we can teach you the right way from the get-go you don't have to unlearn the wrong way to do it you can just you know follow the instructions here it's very cool um, maybe you've had some experience of video marketing but you just haven't been able to create uh, videos that convert you just haven't uh, that the videos you've created haven't taken off maybe uh, people haven't found the videos useful um, but something's not working something's not right with the videos and you know it and you just don't know what it is and you can't figure it out well I'm gonna help you with that uh, as much as I possibly can so uh, if that's the case you've had some experience don't worry uh, my goal is to give you some good pointers to uh, get you on the right track and uh, you know give you some more uh, inspiration to keep them videos uh, maybe you've always wondered how others create videos and they just seem they just seem to reel in leads clients buyers and they, they just do awesome and amazing um, and you know but you're wondering how to do it without any uh, fancy video setups or, or special gear you know you see some videos and they have like this this giant light stand thing here and then they have this um, you know videographer over there and then there's like another camera guy and and you just think oh it just boggles the mind as to how much preparation they've put in and how much they've spent on all this video equipment and you just think I just want to make a damn video I don't, I don't want to um, go out and, 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 and have to hire half the city and you know to, to help me film it I just want to do the video well you know I was the same as you I just wanted to get a video done and I didn't I didn't have a lot of money when I first began I just you know I wanted to do some videos and as 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 I was able to buy better equipment and, and really go from there so it is possible by the way um, to do videos without needing any of those equipments uh, any any of the expensive tools uh, you know in the beginning especially uh, or maybe maybe you're an experienced marketer and you're just looking for a few tips to uh, really just to help you sharpen your uh, video marketing skills you might really be an absolute video marketing rock star um, if that's the case then it's, it's great to have you here and hopefully I can teach you a thing or two that I've managed to learn over the uh, the last couple of years you know doing video marketing which uh, very much is, is how I've built my uh, my brand and my business really um, there is if there is some more information about me if you go to sebrantigan.net forward slash about you can actually read my story um, but for now I'm just gonna get into the um, main part of the training here so are you a network marketer looking for more leads and more reps are you a home business owner wanting to build a brand are you an internet marketer looking to generate more traffic are you a traditional business owner looking to stand out are you a freelancer wanting to get more work you're a coach and you're looking for more clients are you a real estate agent you're looking to list properties you want these properties to be seen you don't want them to be ignored um, if that's the case if any of these are true to you or you're just looking for uh, using video and you're just looking to you just understand the power of it and you just want to leverage it and use it to its fullest potential then I'm very confident this training can help you do that now why video specifically well the future really is an online video I mean you've got platforms such as uh, YouTube and Facebook and they've really taken over the web I mean respectively they each have over a billion um, users and, and views per day approximately right um, so TV radio and print advertising 
are declining, right? Um, but they're still just as expensive. It's kind of weird. Um, but marketing your business on the internet with a video, uh, for example, is much more cost efficient. Um, so before we learn how we can leverage the power of video, um, so you can start finding your ideal buyers and get them buying from you and not your competitors, well, here's some actual proof that video is taken off and it's here to stay. Now, according to Cisco's Visual Networking Index, by 2019, global consumer internet uh, video traffic will account for 80% of all consumer internet traffic. So 80% of people online will be looking at videos. That's absolutely incredible. And this data was backed up during a 2015 Q3 call where a Facebook founder, uh, Mark Zuckerberg, we all know him, he announced that, the, uh, that Facebook was generating 8 billion video views daily and Facebook is not a uh, exclusively a video website but they do videos right <laughs> um, but Facebook isn't known for its videos and that still gets 8 billion views a day absolutely incredible and while snapchat had you know 15 times fewer users than Facebook did um, it, it, it still generated 7 billion views and snapchat's been around way less time I think since 2008 I'm not too sure but a lot less time than Facebook so it, it really is it, it's growing massively now, if you're looking for customers to take action, um, then you want to consider adding video to your emails, right? It's going to account for a you know two to three hundred percent increase in click-through rate. Uh, another tactic is combining video with full-page ads, and that's supposed to boost engagement by twenty-two percent. Um, if you sell real estate, then here's what you want to know: listings that uh, include a video they actually receive four hundred three percent more inquiries than those without <laughs> isn't that crazy so you get four times as many inquiries with the video uh, here's a crazy one 50 percent of executives look for more information after seeing a product or service in the video in fact 65 percent of them visit the marketers website and 39 percent call a vendor after viewing a video that's how you get people reaching out to you is put a video out there make yourself contactable and if people see value they'll reach out to you and the source is smallbiztrend.com. Um, if you want to uh, check out those those facts there. Right? So um, here's some myths though about video marketing. Um, it, you know, people say this all the time. You need an expensive setup to start creating videos. Well, the truth is, um, you can have those things. There's nothing nothing wrong with that. And at some point, maybe you might. That might be appropriate. But you can start with your smartphone. I've got my I've got an S3 Samsung. It's not even the the latest Samsung. It's a refurbished phone, and I use it most, mostly for the camera on it. It's an HD um, camera, but most most modern smartphones they actually are HD anyway. And I've got a uh, and the thing recording this is a Logitech. Um, I don't know the model, but it's a 720. I just if you put in Logitech HD 720p, I'm just trying to read it here um, from from where I'm sitting. Um, you can get it on Amazon for like twenty dollars or like fifteen pounds if you're in the UK, um, and it is, is one of the best webcams I've ever had, and it's and it's really good quality. It's not the best, but for the price, it is ridiculous, and it's made me uh, much more than I've spent, believe me. Um, and you know, most cameras now that that have been recently made, they're HD as standard anyway. So you know, it is important to have HD quality video, um, but the truth is, almost every camera that is is modern has HD capabilities anyway and most of them have a microphone built in as well. Um, you know, here's another one. My videos have to be perfect. Then the reality is you're never going to get started and you're never going to get exposure. People are never going to look at what you have to have because you're so worried about being perfect. Right? And people are not looking for perfection. They're looking for the right message at the right time. Now here's another one. I've done videos before that did not convert. Um, so I'd recommend staying tuned to the rest of the videos and I'll actually share with you why your videos don't convert. Um, here's another one. Videos are saturated. Well, I already shared with you that Facebook gets 6 billion or 8 billion views a day, I think it was. Um, so there's a virtually never-ending pool of people who are just hungry to watch your videos. And they're in pain. They're struggling. They need um, what your product has to offer in order to finally you know resolve that pain right that's that's what people are looking for so um, you know I, I'd highly recommend you know <laughs> putting all those things out of um, out of your thinking and instead 
you know, start looking at video in a different way. Uh, now here's another one, video marketing myths. So let go of being perfect, just do some videos. Oh, I used to suck at doing videos, but you're only going to get good at them by practicing them over and over. Um, doing videos actually positions you as an expert in your field. It does it very quickly. It's almost like you're the teacher um, in the classroom and they're the student. And you don't need to do any fancy editing. Um, you don't need any advanced software. I use like maybe one or two softwares, uh, but I don't, I don't use anything complicated. You, you know, when I do edit, it's very simple edits that they don't take a lot of time to do. Um, so the goal is just to get out there and start getting exposure to your business and brands. Just start making videos. That's your homework for today. Start practicing, getting good at videos, getting comfortable on the camera, um, and getting good at creating a concise message um, that people want to hear that solves the problems of your target market. Um, and if you're wondering what a good target market is to go for, um, stick around to step two. We're going to cover that. I'm going to flip over and take you to the next video. So uh, stay tuned for that, and we'll see you very shortly.